Many years ago I was recommended this uh, NRS uh, Socade after I damaged my uh, leg and hip badly. found it difficult to put my uh, socks on without uh, pulling on the scar tissue etc etc. Not great if you've got arthritis either. So I found this thing, I was recommended to it by an occupational therapist and it's been uh, brilliant. It's a little bit, um, it's strong, but it's a little bit lighter weight than many of the other ones that you see advertised. And so I find it works quite well. I just thought I'd give you a quick practical demonstration because when you first start with these things, uh, it can be uh, a bit more difficult than you would at first th think. But I'm not a medical professional in any way, manner or means, but uh, this is the way I put it on and find it the easiest way. I only use it for socks because uh, sadly, I don't wear stockings on a Sunday night anymore. But anyway, hey ho. So let's see what happens. So uh, I just uh, feed the uh, the sock. Have the uh, the sock aid like this. So basically, the uh, if you think that's three fingers there. And the bottom uh, finger there, that central finger, is the bottom of the sockade. So then line the bottom piece up there with the heel of your sock. A bit uh, difficult to see, but anyway, there's the heel on the sock. So just put that into the top of the sock. Open the sock up. And as I say, keep the... Uh, Keep the heel there, keep the heel there in line with the bottom finger of the, of the sockade. So pull that on. What I do is I pull that right up till it's completely, so the foot is completely on to the bottom of the sockade. But then I make sure I don't bring the, I uh, found it's best not to bring the uh, sock too far up here, otherwise you find it quite difficult to get it onto your foot. You just have to try by trial and error to uh, see how this works best for you. But uh, you're better to be sitting down unless you're uh, very, very stable on one leg. Uh, so it's safer to sit down to put on your sock. Make sure you wear very nice, colourful socks. I shall now endeavour to sit down and I'll hopefully be able to show you how it uh, pulls on successfully. Make sure I don't trip over the tripod. foot in, push the foot to the bottom and just use the two straps to pull that towards you. And then voila, so you can see that, it's fully on my foot, my foot's now operational and here's one I prepared earlier. Hey, whoopee, job is a good one. Saves a lot of uh, aggravation, but as I say, sit down to do it. Because otherwise, if you're trying to do it one-legged and your balance isn't very good, you're going to probably fall over and break something, which wouldn't be great. So this is the item here. Hopefully you can see that. So that's an NRS, an NRS Socade. So uh, it's got a terry lining, which gives a bit of friction to help it pull the sock onto your... Uh, under your foot. Hope it helps. Please, if it's found the store useful, please do give it the thumbs up and please do subscribe and then I can continue to help Acorns Children's Hospice Worcester and Mind. And thank you to the 328,000 people who have now viewed my different videos. So thank you for your continued support, which is appreciated. It's unusual to have links talking to you. Anyway, there they are. Reminds me of somebody called Sherry Lewis. She's showing my age. There we are. Gives a little bit of shot of it. There's two long cords with handles on the end there. You 
put your hands into those handles and you can pull it and get a lot more tension onto it from there. I'm sure you'll find it helpful. Brilliant piece of kit, not a great deal of money and I've now been using it for, well, I don't know, probably about five, six, maybe ten years and I found it really, really helpful.